Welcome back to yet another great week of Sunday School. This week, we are going to talk about a really cool place. But before we do, I want to ask you this question. What is the coolest, most fun place you've ever been? You know, when I look back, I remember going to Disney World. Disney World was amazing. It was so exciting. People said it was the happiest place in the world. Now, I don't know what you said, but I do know this. There are a lot of amazing places. And I want you to go back into that time, into that moment when you were at that place. Many of you were probably excited and you had so much fun. Now today we're going to talk about a place that's even better. Does anyone know what that place could be called? Some of you got it right. Exactly. Today we are talking about heaven. You know, we hear over and over, heaven is a wonderful place. It's filled with only happiness, with only joy, and someday we get to all live there together. Now let's stand and sing as we praise and worship our amazing God. There's no way you won't go Nothing you won't do No place that I could hide You were always in pursuit I'm never too far gone Always in your side When I wait for you You're always right on time you're always pursuing, always pursuing, always pursuing me More than the air I breathe I need you here with me And you're never gonna stop, never gonna stop And you're never gonna stop, never gonna stop chasing me You have my heart Now and forevermore You're always pursuing Always pursuing Always pursuing me More than the air I breathe I need you here with me And you're never gonna stop Never gonna stop And you're never gonna stop Never gonna stop chasing Hey kids, have you ever thought about what heaven is like? 
Maybe you saw on a TV show it was going to be a big white room. Or maybe you think it's going to be a never-ending, boring day. The Bible gives a hint to what it's like. So let's find out. Heaven is a lot different than Earth. Earth can be a really sad place where really bad things happen. Things like war and mean people and sickness and death. There are a lot of things that can make life really sad and tough. In heaven, there isn't any of that stuff. So we won't have to be sad ever again. Heaven is better than the best birthday party you've ever been to. Think of the funnest birthday party you've ever been to. Maybe there are a lot of candies, party hats, and party games. In heaven, we will have more fun than that party. Heaven is a place filled with color and life, not a boring white room nothing, with nothing to do. In fact, the Bible tells us that heaven will have streets of gold. And there will be no more crying and no more pain. It will be like one big celebration all the time. And do you know what we will be celebrating in heaven? In heaven, we get to be with Jesus forever. That's what we'll be celebrating. We get to live with Jesus forever. Once we get there, we'll be able to spend all kinds of time with Him. You might not think that's very cool, but just think about it. God created the whole entire universe, and you get to hang out with Him. That is awesome. Now kids, there's one more very important thing we should know about heaven. There's only one way to get to heaven. The only way to get into heaven is by rubbing your belly and patting your head at the same time. Just kidding, that would be ridiculous. The only way to get to heaven is through Jesus. There's no other way, not even being a really nice or good person. Memory verse. Jesus told him, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one can come to the Father except through me. The only way to get to heaven is believing that Jesus died on the cross for your sins. That's it. That's all you have to do. So kids, the next time you're thinking about what heaven might be like, don't think of a boring white room. Think of an awesome party with God. And if you want to be that cool party called heaven, talk to a parent or teacher today. Ladies and gentlemen, girls and boys, please rise and prepare yourselves to be moved by God's amazing power. Calvary Dance Team will be worshiping with you. In this moment, we ask you to set everything aside as we open our eyes, ears, and hearts to God's amazing power. Let's set everything aside and give it up to our one, our only, our amazing God. Your broken heart is the power. Yeah. 
Everybody clap your hands. Now stop.